I made a video recently where I shared a face mask that I can use for under eye masks and under eye bags. We are going to be following up with the cream today. Hello beautiful people, welcome to my channel. We are going to be using three major ingredients. I have my pure almond oil here. Almond oil is very good. Apart from it being very healthy, as an healthy thing to eat or something, it's also very good for your skin. It has lightening properties and hydrating properties, moisturizing properties that can help to restore your skin tone and help to balance the pH of your skin. The second ingredient I'm going to be using is my vitamin E oil. Some people usually get the vitamin E capsules, but I find it easier to use this oil like this. It's very good for the hair and the skin. It helps against damage control. It helps to stimulate growth and helps to like balance the skin tone. It's also very good against anti-aging, wrinkles, fine lines on the skin. It has excellent moisturizing properties. Vitamin E oil is considered as 100% a pure moisturizing oil. And the last ingredient I'm going to be using is my pure aloe vera gel. This is the one that I bought in the store, not the organic one, but this is also very good. Aloe vera gel contains antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties, excellent for the skin, great for skin care. One of the skin care ingredients out there that helps to balance your skin, restores the pH of your skin, guides against inflammation on the skin against unwanted things on the skin like if you have acne you have eczema you have almost anything on the skin you want to get rid of aloe vera gel is what to use very quickly i'll just take my vitamin a oil first it's usually very thick if you're using the capsule you can use like just one or two of the capsule i'm just going to take a bit of that and that's okay you need just a little bit because vitamin a oil is usually very very thick i have my almond oil here as well i'll be adding about half a teaspoon of my almond oil and the last thing i'm going to be adding is my aloe vera gel i'm going to go ahead and give this a good mix turned white which is perfectly okay so let me just go ahead and show you how you can apply it on your face as an under eye cream so guys now that we have our mix you take a bit of that clean hands you massage it into your skin you need just a bit per time because of the vitamin E and the aloe, and the aloe vera it's going to come out as like very thick but it's okay you can massage it all over your lids but be careful don't let it get into your eyes Our focus is here. So by the time you do this for like one or two minutes, you see that the cream has like disappeared into your skin. Make sure you massage it well because that's the other thing you need to do don't just apply it you need to massage it very well into your skin and this is okay for you to do 
at your free time it depends on you if you want to do this before going to bed it's absolutely fine if you want to do this when you wake up after you've washed your face it's absolutely fine it all depends on you and you can do it like every day this is like something that you should do like once you notice that you have eye bags you can do this like repeatedly every day every single time you notice that the bags are there if you've done the mask for the eyes you can go on with this one to moisturize it and guys in no time there'll be nothing like under eye bags nothing of the sort you see bye bye to circles dark eye circles under eye circles doing this is going to help you help your face tremendously it's going to make your face pop more you notice that there's a difference on your face you notice the glow even though you're just applying it just underneath your eyes it's going to like help your face overall it's going to help your face pop glow all those darkness all those under eye bags will disappear but you have to do just this you have to do the work and the product will also do the work so just three ingredients your vitamin a oil your almond oil and your aloe vera gel these are the things you need to form your under eye cream and you can continue to do this so the residue you have you can just put it in a small container or a small bottle you can put it in your fridge or you can put it at room temperature don't mix too much at a time out because they are not putting any preservative do the aloe vera gel and the oils will keep but i usually just advise not to mix a lot at a time you can do like something for a week two weeks if it finishes mix it separate and a new fresh batch so guys i hope you enjoyed this video today if you did please give this video a thumbs up let me know if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you've not subscribed please just click the red subscribe button and the button beside it which makes you know when i drop brand new videos i would love to see you come back again and again stay beautiful because you're beautiful bye